You welcome back to Channel Sport this morning. We're in the home stretch now. And it's time to just uh, I'll spare a thought for Tottenham Hot Four because over the weekend, okay, yesterday actually, uh, they ended the Stamford Bridge, uh, Stamford Bridge uh, jinx uh, by defeating Chelsea uh, by three goals to one. Chinasa, you start that game, uh, it looks like uh, with that victory uh, for Tottenham, top four is looking very good. And for Chelsea, uh, it looks like um, uh, their hopes are diminished. Yeah, it, 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 it's. You know, getting uh, worse for them by the day. You know, it we don't think of yeah, the, uh, the top four place. Mm. You know, uh, if you didn't watch that game yesterday, if a uh, diehard Tottenham, Tottenham fan, if he was told the result, he would think he would have thought he was he, you were playing an April Fool's prank on him because they hadn't won there in, since the start of the Premier League. You know, in the Premier League era, they had never won at uh, Stamford Bridge until yesterday. So a good one for them. They went there, they won the game, uh, coming from behind. Coming that's, from behind that, again. Not, not you just, think the not just the fact that they actually won. They came from behind right. at Stamford Bridge, mm. a place they had never won Before, in, the league, in, the Premier league. in the Premier League, you know, okay. to go to get a victory. So, sweet one for them. And also, Dele Ali, who hasn't, who hadn't scored, has scored just one goal in 17 games. What a yeah. Sprouts is this, you know, scoring two in four minutes. Mm. Good one for Tottenham. Good one for Tottenham. And um, expectedly, uh, when you, you know, uh, get this kind of sweet victories, yeah. the players are quick to go to social of media. Course. If you lose, uh, they forget <laughs> their phone somewhere. But if they win, uh, they go to social media. And yeah. that's the guy there. 28 years since we've beaten Chelsea at Stamford Bridge, it was really a good one for them because he contributed to goals Absolutely. There. This is where I'm coming from. Uh, Jean Vertonghen. saying unbelievable. Okay, unbelievable performance from the team. And of course, the one coming from Eric Lamala, he says the derby means a lot to us. We wanted a win and we got it. Come on, three point deserved. They've come and close course, a couple of Christian times. Christian Eriksen, Christian Eriksen who Eriksen scored fantastic that stunner. Fantastic 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 comeback yeah. and a deserved win. But for, yeah, I know your goalkeeper union and stuff like that. You don't want to blame the goalie. Uh, that ball was straight down the middle. Yeah. It should have done better. It was yeah. swerving. You know, it was the way it was it was the, it was the swerve on the ball. That, okay. that was that deceived him, right. The goalkeeper, yeah. Okay, so that's the four uh for Tottenham and beating Chelsea. Let's quickly run through the NBA uh, uh, NBA action uh from early this morning. Some very interesting results are involving Nigerian players uh in action. Uh the Afro Camino uh, had a very good game for his team. Uh, uh the Blazers uh, they defeated the Memphis Grizzlies 113 uh 98. There were also wins uh for the Indiana Pacers, uh, the San Antonio Spurs, Cleveland Cavaliers, OKC Thunder, uh, the Warriors also won on the night. But let's just quick Victor spare Oladipo. a thought for Victor Oladipo. Yeah, and, um, 30 points. And um, Alfredo Camino. That's yeah, point. Uh, uh, Victor Oladipo is having a breakout season. Mm -hmm. uh, he left uh, OKC and went to uh, Pace, as we uh, a lot of people felt, uh, why did he didn't make that move? But you can see now he's the man at he's the at main Pace, man, and they're playing really well. You know, he's getting uh, uh, fantastic game time and doing really well for his team. So, uh, Afaru Kamino too, contributing uh, uh, for his Hot team, man. and it's it, it's really good seeing these guys, but uh. Unfortunately, they can't play. Uh, Victor can't play for Nigeria. Why not? Why not? Uh, he's been invited a couple of times. Why not? We're still going to get him. He wants Don't to play for up. Team USA, and now he's playing really he's playing well. He's playing really well. So right. he, might, he, might, he, might, he might get, okay. call, he might okay. get called up to the national Let's team. still keep hoping, man. Let's keep the hope alive. Uh, to perhaps now uh, we can get uh, Victor Oladipo uh, to play for Nigeria. Let's quickly run through the papers. So the papers now, yeah. so Sporting Life, I'll start with this one. Russia 2018 World Cup. Expect some changes in Eagles if that's coming from... Gennett Road to increase competition in camp. Okay. So he, he has a scouting team now that is actually scouting everywhere. Mm -hmm. Okay, Joshua and Wider fight talks begin next week. Fantastic. See if that's going to happen. And Sporting Stone is the next now. And did they reject Arsenal move? I love the picture <laughs> in front of them. He's looking, Arsenal? No way. Yeah, that, that's yeah, what it used to be like. On, Arsenal is <laughs> a big side, even though they've been poor recently. Yeah, still he doesn't side. want to struggle with those teams. Um, last thing for review, Complete okay, Sports. Uh, Complete Sports is the last one, of course, still on under the brushes of Arsenal, Arsenal transfer talk. talk. Okay. Okay. Go to Barcelona or Liverpool. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and yes. Anthony Joshua says, I'm following the path legend's work. Mm. That's a good one. He's trying to be a legend as well, yep. too. And he is already one. I wish him all the best. All He's the on best. his way to being a legend. Chinasi, thank you uh, for coming on the show. Appreciate all, your time. Always a pleasure, Tyler. Thank you. Full time. Yep. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I'm Cecilia. I'm all good. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm Tyler. Salam.